we are group 3 here to present on the topic 10 biggest mega projects in the world. So the mega projects that we'll be discussing today are the Great Wall of China, International Space Station, Panama Canal, Burj Khalifa, the Great Pyramid of Giza, the Golden Gate Bridge, uh, Brooklyn Bridge, English Canal Tunnel, Hoover Dam, and Aqueduct of Segovia. Great Wall of China. So, the total length of the Great Wall of China is 21196.18 km, making it the largest, making it the longest structure in, in the world. So who could have ever come up with this crazy idea of just joining walls and making it the longest, right? So around 220 BCE, Queen Xing Huang, also called the first emperor of United China, and he was the one who came up with the concept of developing these walls. And he sent the Chinese prisoners in building of this as their punishment. So this um, wall took over like 2,000 years to construct. And um, till now, earthquakes and any natural disasters have not destroyed this, uh, this structure, probably because of the good old sticky rice which was used to construct this uh, structure. Burj Khalifa. So the height of Burj Khalifa is 8 to 8 meters, making it the um, tallest building of the world. So AMR Properties PJ, PJSC is the master developer and designer of Burj Khalifa and they uh, came up with the concept of building this. So this skyscraper alone holds six world records that are um, tallest freestanding structure. It has the highest number of stories, has the highest occupied floors, the highest outdoor observation deck, has, high, has elevator with longest travel distance and tallest service elevator in the world. So now to get the height of Burj Khalifa in perspective, it is equal to that, like it is tall, it is like three times as tall as the Eiffel Tower and nearly as twice as tall as the Empire State Building. So the weight of this building is 500,000 tons. To get this to perspective again, it is equivalent to 100,000 elephants, the concrete used in this building. And the aluminum used in this building is equivalent to uh, that of five A380 planes. And at the peak of construction, 12,000 like, workers were working every day for six years to build this project. And um, the total construction cost of Rich Khalifa was reported to amount to like more than $1.5 billion. <coughs> International Space Station. So International Space Station is the largest man-made structure on space. So how exactly did this giant get into space? So it was all built in Earth, and then it was launched to the space, and it was all assembled in the orbit of the Earth, or, or orbit of the space. So, um, uh, so this ISS is used to conduct science ex scientific experiments, which can only be done in space. So each of these lines represent the addition of new module to the station. So this project took over decades to complete. So these are like all the um, like all the new pod, new like structures added to the ISS. So usually six astronauts on uh, are on board in ISS. They live there. But they switch out every six months, so making sure that no one spends too much time on space. And ISS is the size of an American football field. And um, the ISS only takes about 92 minutes to orbit the Earth. That's about 28,000 kilometer per hour. And once construction started, ISS took a little over decades to be considered complete. So next we have the Great Pyramid of Giza. Okay, so out of seven pyramids in Egypt, this Pyramid of Giza is the largest pyramid located in El Giza, Egypt. This pyramid was also constructed about 4,700 4, years ago 
and to this day it is one of the most talked about mega projects or topics in the world. This pyramid took 20 to 27 years to build and its original height was 481 feet but the current height is 449.5 feet tall where logic or theory has it that the intense weather of this environment caused the pyramid to decrease. This pyramid is also made to honor King Khufu's death and generally it's also called Khufu's Pyramid. Next we have the Panama Canal. Panama Canal is one of the most popular or important canals in the world and it is a shortcut between Antarctic Atlantic and the Pacific Ocean. So a fun fact about this canal is that it transports 4% of the world trade uh, but the saddening fact about this canal is it took uh, almost about 25,000 lives to be constructed and this is also located in Panama and it took 10 years to build. Along with it we have the Golden Gate Bridge. So as the name sounds golden but it's not really golden, it's a bright red orange. It is named the seven wonders of the modern world. It is one of the seven wonders of the modern world and it took almost four years to build. Next we have the Brooklyn Bridge. The Brooklyn Bridge was the first T-wire suspension bridge that was built at that time. Uh, all, the, all the time, at the time it was built, it was actually the longest suspension bridge in the world, but then it got beaten by Wilson, Wilson Burns Bridge. It is located in, located in NYC. The height of this bridge is 39 uh, meters and the length is 486 meters in total. It was designed by John A. Robling and it was con the construction began in 1869 and the project was finally completed in 1883. Next we have the English Channel Tunnel. The English Channel Tunnel is the longest undersea tunnel in the world. It is a, uh, it is a train slash subway uh, tunnel to connect the southeast uh, part of England with the southeast part of uh, France. Uh, the tunnel itself is considered of three tunnels. Two of them are railways and one is a support tunnel uh, used to if in, in emergency cases, to provide help in case of emergency, such as uh, the case in 1983, no, 99, 2010, where a fire had caught on and there was no way to uh, help uh, passengers back. It connects the, sorry, its construction began in 1988 and it was completed in 1994. Hoover Dam. Hoover Dam is a constructed Arctic gravity dam in uh, the Black Canyon of the uh, Colorado River on the border between the U U.S. state of uh, Nevada and Arizona. It was opened on March uh, March 1st, 1936. The height of this dam is 20, uh, 2,021 meters. The area of this dam is 64, uh, 640 km square. Uh, adequate of Cebu, Cebu, Cebu yeah. uh, so it it is in Rome, uh, it is in Spain, uh, it is it is built from stone uh, stone brick and cement. The total length of it, it is uh, seven seven hundred ninety four meter. The height of it is uh, twenty eight meter. It was designed on eleven October eighteen eighty four. So this concludes our presentation. Hope you guys learned about the